So we're really excited today to have a global professional basketballer who was drafted 33rd overall in the WNBA by Indiana Fever in 2011 and who's played in numerous countries around the world to pursue her professional basketball career. So it's with great pleasure to welcome Jory Davis to the show to share her secrets and sacrifices of her professional basketball journey so far and much, much more. So Jory, welcome to the show. Thank you. I'm, I'm so glad to be on the Elite Children podcast. It's been a while, but we're here. Uh, we are, we, we, it, was a, it was a bit of a journey to get you on, but we've got there in the end. So we really, really made up that you could join us today. Um, so before we start, one of the many reasons that we wanted to get you on the show was a documentary that we saw a while ago called Basketball Overseas, A Lost Community. Um, basically, it was trying to highlight the misconceptions of playing basketball overseas and highlighting to people that it's not always a fancy and a lavish lifestyle, earning lots and lots of money. Um, and it was a must watch and it was a great watch, we thought. And it was one of the reasons that we started the podcast in the first place to try and shine the light on the secrets and sacrifices all professional athletes go through to kind of make it to the top. And it's not always that podium finish that everybody kind of sees. So thank you for having that voice and thank you for sharing that story because we, we thought it really kind of highlighted what all the athletes kind of go through uh, and something that we're trying to uh, really reinforce on this show. So so that, yeah. was, that was a great watch. Yeah, well, thank you guys for, for watching and spending the time, of course, to, to look at it. Um, so yeah, it was, it was a short clip. Hope to yeah. make it work. Yeah, um, I definitely wanted to just put that out there uh, yeah. for anyone who, who was maybe looking or who would come across that message. Yeah, I think I think think um, say like podcasts and and little kind of shows like that. The the I think they're always great to to kind of shine the light on professional athletes because I know from 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 our background and from my four children currently starting that journey it is quite kind of easy for parents to get kind of carried away to kind of see that podium finish straight away. And they, they don't actually see all the hard work and the, the kind of sacrifices that we'll kind of go through shortly um, that allows the professional athlete to kind of make it to the top. So, okay. So before we start the show, my children have come up with 10 quick fire, would you rather questions? And, and normally it's my children that ask the questions for you. They write the questions themselves. Um, however, unfortunately, they're all away competing today. So today you're stuck with me, Jory. Um, so my first question is, uh, would you rather game or read a book? Read a book. Read a book. Um, would you rather win a million or earn a million? Earn a million. Okay. Would you rather have a takeaway or eat out? Eat out. Eat out. Uh, listen to Stormzy or listen to Drake? Drake. Drake. Uh, would you rather wear Nike or Adidas? Yeah, Nike. Nike. Uh, would you rather own a Bugatti or a Lamborghini? A Lamborghini. Uh, would you rather do cardio or lift weights? Lift weights. Uh, would you rather be too hot or too cold? Mm, too cold. Too cold. Uh, would you rather play one-on-one -on -one against Michael Jordan or Shaquille O'Neal? Michael Jordan. Michael Jordan. Uh, and the last one is, would you rather wear dunks or Jordan 1s? Jordan 1s. Super duper. Thank you very much for that. 